so finally guys ios 11 beta version come out and this is how it look like as you can see it so clean looking ios 11 and you can see this frame running few apps is new such as itunes as you can see app store next page we have file and also the calculator app and also the layout is different as well so let me just get the wi-fi and show you what i'm talking about so as you can see uh, this is now newly app store in ios 11 and also itunes as well they change everything in ios 11 and itunes i think the same yep maybe some glitch still guys is this beta version got glitches which is i do see that some glitches sometimes i try to open the camera but does not opening and also this thing is up like right there about like two hours ago and i have to like reboot the phone but anyway guys other than that this is work good as new so let me turn out the wi-fi and uh, let me just show you this file is one gigabyte and 88 1.88 gigabyte here as you can see this big file and I was running 10.3.2 and as you can see before and after I was 11 and by the way this is a 2.2 Geekbench score this is after I was 11 downloading and this 10.3.2 as you can see how better is 10.3.2 which is I was 10.3.2 versus ios 11 that worse score as you can see it and also this ios 11 do have a lot of new features such as as you can see setting application now look different as you can see some things are new which is series as you can see it emergency sos which is we don't see in ios 10 and this password and accounts and some few features as you can see but still let me show you one thing go setting in general accessibility and display management and go turn this on top version smart and you got the dark mode you can say black mode but after you're turning on that thing everything such as even this phone dialer got black as you can see it's colorful still is colorful but some app is says black like this one and sorry about the focus guys as you can see that and let me show the app store as well i'm losing the focus sorry about that guys but as you can see the app store kind of black still you can see the colors look at that tiger and also the and itunes everything got black this kind of handy tool and also if you go setting everything black even the games you are playing kind of colorful games as you can see this subway surfer let me just play a little bit and i was dead but anyway guys this is kind of dark mode in ios 11 and also guys one more new feature which is i really like it when you're taking screenshot so one two three you got this shot right there and you can add it or you can draw the it you can put the numbers you can resize this image it's a pretty cool feature to have in iphone 8 or maybe ios 11. so guys this is ios 11 beta version as I told you still has glitches but if you do not know how to download it I stay till end of this video I'm gonna show you how to download step by step so guys if you do, do not know how to download it just follow my step here as you can see I'm gonna open Safari I'm provided this link in the box you can check it out tap this this here and this link and allow it will take you to the setting install install and install let's say restart the device after that done it will come as this normal looking ios 10.3.2 whichever software or framework you're running as you can see still i have ios 10 not 11 
let's just go into setting here and in general and software updates it will receive this kind of message as you can see i did told you 1.88 in my iphone 7 but this is success here and i got 1.9 gigabytes it's a little bit more but still just say install and it's doing some work so i'll catch you after i don't know how much time will take maybe a few minutes here so guys it'll work with the iphone 5s and up and also in ipad ipad air air 2 and ipad 9.7 inch in the pro version ipad 7.9 inch 12.9 inch and 10.9 inch and if you have ipod touch 6th generation it does work with ios 11 so only like handful of devices work with this ios 11 beta so yeah guys i'll catch you after a few minutes here as soon as it's finished as you can see four minutes here so yeah i'll, I'll catch you after as soon as it's finished and show you running ios 11 in there so guys finally ios 11 installed in my 6s here this is the first screen you are seeing after downloading and then just tap the home button this will not you will not see this one screen you seeing some you have to follow some steps you have to add the apple id or fingerprint scanner or passcode and then you will see this one so just tap start it so guys finally install ios 11 as you can see the new calculator app file application and new interface as you can see it difference so that's how you download the ios 11 i'll show you step by step how how can you download iOS 11? It's sim guys, it's really really simple to download iOS 11. It's not that hard, but still it has some glitches, so it might be give you some problems in the future. I have still problem with this iPhone 7. I, I'm be using this iPhone since, which is iOS 11 since this morning. I just downloaded it and I have some problems in this iOS 11. Got some time glitches, as I told you before. So maybe give you the problem and by the way guys this is how the app drawer now look as you can see you can swipe it and just swipe up to go delete the application which was running in the background so let me just run the geekbench score i'm gonna run geekbench 4 and compare to the last year what we're going to see it so let me just i've already run it guys so i'm gonna show you so as you can see it let me get the focus so as you can see See it guys that is the first one you seeing is iOS 11 the second one you seeing is iOS 10.3.2 just compared guys look how good is iOS 10.3.2 this is the worst iOS 11 beta version still but still I beat it by iOS 10.3.2 here and I really like this face guys it's really cool face so yeah guys if you like this video give me a thumbs up and if you have any question about this ios 11 let me know in the comment below and i'll catch you next one peace out